The DMES command displays messages from the kernel ring buffer, providing crucial system information about hardware detection, driver loading, and kernel events. Think of it as a system's diary, logging important activities and issues as they happen. The basic syntax of the DMES command is very simple. To use it, just type DMES in your terminal, followed by any options you want to use. For example, to display all kernel ring buffer messages, simply type DMESC. Sometimes you might need administrative privileges to access all the information. In that case, you can use sudo DMESC. Here are some essential flags that you can use with the DMESC command. The C option clears the buffer after reading the messages. H provides human readable timestamps, making it easier to understand when events occurred. T prints human readable time directly in the output. W waits for new messages, allowing you to monitor the system in real time. For output control, X decodes facility and level codes into human readable text. K prints only kernel messages. U shows only user space messages. Finally, N sets the console log level, allowing you to filter messages based on their importance. To filter messages using grep for specific keywords or patterns, you can use commands like dmesc pipe grep, followed by the keyword you're looking for, such as error. To ignore case, you can add the I option like dmesc pipe grep, IUSB. You can also search for specific interfaces like F0. To display the last 20 messages, use dmesc pipe tail minus 20. To see the first 10 messages, use dmesc pipe head minus 10. For real time monitoring, you can follow new messages continuously with dmesc pipe tail F. Kernel messages are categorized by priority levels. Critical levels, indicated by numbers 0 to 3, are for emergency and alert messages. Level 4 is for error conditions. Level 5 represents warning conditions. Levels 6 and 7 are for informational messages. You can filter messages by specific priority levels. For example, to see only error messages, use DMESC L error. To see both warning and error messages, use DMESC L warn error. You can also use the level option like DMESC. Level equals info to display informational messages. To monitor kernel messages in real time as they appear in the buffer, you can use dmesc w or dmesc follow. The watch command can also be useful. For example, watch in one dmesc will run dmesc every one second. You can also combine options for more effective monitoring. For instance, Dmesk W follows messages with human readable timestamps. Alternatively, you can use Dmesk W pipe grep to filter specific events as they occur in real time. Here are some practical examples of how to use Dmesk for troubleshooting. To check USB device detection and errors, use Dmesk pipe grep IUSB. To monitor the status of network interfaces, use Dmesk pipe grep IF or Wi Fi. To detect memory related issues, use DMESC pipe grep iMemory. To check early boot messages, use DMESC pipe head minus 50. To find recent errors with timestamps, use DMESC T pipe grep i error. To monitor storage device status, use DMESC pipe grep ISDA or disk. If you like this video, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Visit CodeLucky.com for more such useful content.